Hello, hello, Mana here, and welcome back to Tiny Thor. And how good is this music? I've just been sitting here listening to it for the last couple of minutes. It's like, it's so good, I really love it. But uh, that aside, uh, I decided actually to come back and finish up since it, I assume the last level is only going to be, you know, 20, 30 minutes at, at most, probably less. Um, but also because I completely forgot about the shader, which is the main reason that I actually decided to do this again, because I, I did uh, mean to actually try out the uh, CRT shader, so. Since I forgot, I thought this would be a good opportunity to do it, so yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> we'll uh, see how we go, and yeah, should be good. Let's uh, let's see, well, I guess we'll just go with, ooh, alright. Oh, okay. Oh, wow, alright. That's, oh, alright, that's interesting. I wonder how that looks for you. Because, like, okay, let's, let's go out of this for a sec. I love that it's, like, not just that there's a CRT shader, by the way. But that you actually have these options, like to actually adjust it, which I think is very awesome. I, I gotta say though, this actually looks like really good on my screen, but in OBS, it does not look good. Like it, it, it has like these weird streaks going all through it. Whereas for me on my monitor, I gotta say this is actually a. Like, I'm surprised. This is a really nice shader. Like, it's not, like, perfect CRT, I guess. I mean, well, that's not even really a thing, I mean. But, you know, like, because they, they all look, they do, they look different, but this is, like, really nice. Like, I could actually see myself using this particular filter, like, uh, like, for emulation and stuff. Like, it's actually really, really nice. I'm sort of, I'm really surprised how, how, how much I like this. Like, I rarely use, I don't use, CR, like, CRT filters that much with gaming. Um, some older games, I think it's nice. Like, especially some PlayStation 1 games. You do it right can look really nice wow i'm, I'm really uh, I'm impressed by this although because obs looks so friggin weird right now i'm gonna have to double check before we continue oh that music this, this is the best part of it i love this bit it's just so good uh but as for the filter so if it looks weird to you you may need to watch this in full screen or if you're in, on desktop uh, at least adjust the window size I don't know for sure if it's going to be the same result, but I just tried the uh, file I recorded the last couple of minutes um, in a normal media player. And at full screen, it looked exactly the same for me. At certain sizes, it also looked pretty much like that. But he got down smaller and I could see those waves. But even at other sizes, it had sort of a, yeah, an off look to it. So if this doesn't look nice to you, like whether you like CRT shaders or not, but like if it looks a bit off, like it's not something that would be at least nice to someone, you may need to adjust. I, I don't know if that'll actually be the case in the end. Uh, I've, I've never, I don't think I've ever recorded anything with a CRT shader in, in it, so yeah, I'm really not sure about this, but for me, it looks so good. Uh, but yeah, so interesting stuff. Um, so very cool that there is some options here for it, but I, I'm not feeling any need to change it. Uh, it certainly does darken it, like if we throw it a, whoops, if we, like you can see, it's definitely a lot darker, that's for sure. Uh, and I do, like, I don't know. You notice it's got the curve setting, so it's sort of like you are, you know, on an old, uh, you know, curved in screen, but, you know, and I, I normally would say that I'm mixed on that. It wouldn't be something I'd normally go for, but I've got to say, it looks really good to me. Like, I feel like this is a really well done filter. I'm, I'm really impressed. Um, is that, that would be, oh yeah, okay. So let's throw it off. I think, I think, I'll, I'll, yeah, I think that's better. Like, actually, I think it was really well done. But I think for this, we'll we'll stick with just keeping it flat. Um, oh, is there others? Oh, I'm gonna say it's, like this art style is also very good for it. I think um, some of these look really good. I'm gonna say I really like the VGA. That actually looks really nice, and that not so much. Was that? Oh yeah, that was okay. So it is. Okay, so that doesn't seem to be resetting. Oh, right, because... I didn't know if these were all curved as well. Okay, yeah. I feel like VGA looks the best here. I don't know. This is nice, though. I do. I really like this, too. Alright, we'll, we'll turn that off. I don't know. Let me know what you think of the shader and the warping. Like, I think I'd leave it on if I was just playing, but I don't know. I feel like for recording, maybe it's best to go flat. I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of weird, I guess, with using this filter, seeing it like that, because there's so many different devices and size screens that someone will view on, so I, I really don't know how this is going to go. But uh, let's get to the actual game, since I've been talking for way too long. <laughs> uh, at least this is the second video, it's fine. Sort of. 
Get ready. Broken Ridge. All right. Ooh. It looks good. It does. It looks great. On OBS, it looks like terrible. There's like streaks. Uh, this looks... I love it. I do wish... I, I think the only thing from this that is a little bit disappointing is it's like knocking down the, the vividness of the colors. How do the others go for that? Because I think VGA might be a bit better on that. Uh, maybe a little. Yeah, I think, v, I think VGA is a tad more vivid. I'm thinking go, I'm going to go with this one because I kind of assume this is... I, I don't know for sure, but I assume this is like the one that was made for the game. So we'll go with that. Uh, but also like knocking out some of that like bright vivid color does sort of happen with, uh, you know, a filter. But still... Yeah, really, really nice. I think the, the character model seems to be affected the most by it. Like, everything else is really good. Even then, I still really like it. Hmm. Alright, well, let's get to the level. Very nice. What have we got down here? Some snails? Uh, oh, and right. Oh, okay. That, 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 let's... Okay, that didn't... <laughs> that went well. Alright, that's fine. Not at all fine, but that's fine. Okay, awkward little cut there, don't worry about it. <laughs> I just want to double check something. And yes, that was about these snails, a suggestion. Um, Gust Gabe? Mm, I'm going to assume that's how to say your name. Apologize if it's not. Uh, appreciate the comment. I'm assuming Gust Gabe would have to be how it is, but part of me is like, is it, could it be Gust Garbe? <laughs> is that? I don't know. Sorry. I'll call you Gust. That, that's a, I like that name. Okay, anyway. Uh, what you said, like, to maybe kill this snail. Well, the, okay, I can read the exact comment. Urgh. That would probably be the smarter thing to do, wouldn't it? Maybe to kill those snails, you have to throw the axe while backwards and jump before the axe comes to you, so it would hit them while they're looking at you. Yeah, that's that that seems spot on. Like that yeah, I did not think of that. That is that is a very good idea to try, so that is exactly what we're gonna do. That's yeah, I, I was like I when I read that, I'm like, ah. Yeah, that that does make a hell of a lot of sense. Especially like with the whole bouncing off the screen thing, so there shouldn't really be any environment where that, that should wouldn't be possible. I think. But yeah, I couldn't believe I didn't think of that. Like, that's, yeah. So, spot on there, I am thinking. Which, I don't know how we, like, so... Oh, alright. I don't know. It's a little bit awkward on the slope, isn't it? But I think that's sort of the, the way to do it. Uh, I guess it's... Well, let's see. Like, should we... Oh, what's gonna happen here? Oh, okay. I mean, there's, like, I, I want to try that, but these, I, I think that probably is the way to do it. I'm just not sure if these are the best snails to try it on. Can I? Oh, okay, they do die like that. Cool. Oh, all right. Wait, what if I go, wait, wasn't there another one? I mean, if I can get it, to... all right, come down here. Good. Now, if we go, oh, god damn it. That almost worked. I'm pretty sure this is what's good. I just, I really want to confirm or not. I also, I really like that it actually works like that, that does the, the attacks. Cool. All right, you're there. So I, if I go over here. Oh, all right, that didn't. But if I did it, yeah, okay. Come on, snail. Good. Slowly come down here. Oop. <laughs> come here, hammer. Good. Let's jump. Go. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. So, it is, I mean, it, it makes sense just in the fact that, yeah, you need to hit them when they're up. My way of trying to spam and awkwardly catch them, yeah, that, that, that did not work well. But it was working, because I guess there was just like a frame or two probably where you can awkwardly get that, but... Yeah, that seems to be the way to go. That's, it. that's, uh, yeah. I can't even think of that, though. Like, it feels like, like something so obvious to try after actually hearing it, yet no, I didn't even remotely think of it, not even gonna try and act like I did. No, very nice, very nice. Alright. Hopefully that can get us through the level. I appreciate the comment on that. Uh, did that just... Oh, okay. Good? No, 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 no. Thank you. Well, I don't know if we should be... Hmm. How did I know? How did I know? I was like, hmm. There was a lot more secrets in that last level. I wonder. <laughs> and apparently, yes. Okay, very good. Uh, I should probably do... Oh, shit. That didn't work out so well. Oh, back to the start. That's rough. I mean, we haven't gone that far, I guess. Just been taking forever. <laughs> Good. Yeah, we're literally just here. Not not actually a big deal at all, is it? 
We've got our health, good. This is so... Yeah, I don't know what I actually did then. I don't know how I... I must have just clicked off that or something. I don't know why I did that. I mean, I think it was my fault, but I don't know how I managed it. Uh, oh. I was going to jump for that. No need. So that's, uh, that's really something I should keep in mind. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. I thought I was actually going off the edge. That wouldn't have been cool. But damn. Okay. 37 of 193. Somehow I don't think we're going to be getting them all. Uh, is this... Should we be... Hmm. Is this somewhere we need to throw... Oh, shit. Okay, I think now I see what happened. Uh, okay, so if you're holding this... Like, if you try and walk or anything, um, you're, you can't. Like, you have to actually take your finger off to actually walk. Jumping, on the other hand, works. So, yes, yeah, so if, if I'm pressing, um, like... So, like, I start like this, right? I'm pushing... Now I'm actually holding the trigger the other way. If I jump, I'll actually go that way. Even though otherwise I'm completely grounded for any other movement. So yeah, that, that's what happened there, just uh, be curious. So don't misclick, that's what, yeah, standing on the edge and then accidentally hitting A instead of X. Yeah, doesn't work out so well. Let's try and get up here. Whoop, 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 good. Oh, okay. Stop on the outside. Oh, what? All right. I guess that explains it. We just go... Oh! Oh, okay. I thought this was gonna be like straight through, we'd have to... Yeah, alright. Not too bad. Oh, there we go. Very nice. Maybe we'll actually be able to get everything. Somehow I doubt it though. Right, these uh... So if I like do... Oop! That didn't... That did not work. Uh... Yeah, it, it feels awkward, but it, I mean it makes perfect sense, just... How do I... Like that? Yeah. This is, yeah, something like that. That works. It's a little weird. It works. I'm pretty damn sure that's how you meant to do it. Yeah, it makes a lot more sense than what I was trying, so... Not bad. Uh, I'm gonna assume we got everything that way, I don't know. I'm not gonna be crazy about it. I, I would like to try and get everything if we can, but... It's probably not... Oh, what the fuck? Oh, okay. I didn't, that, that gained a lot of speed. What was up with that? I didn't think we had to worry about them ones. Oop. Oh, God damn it! Yeah, I didn't think they were anything even worth worrying about. That's why I was just jumping over them. Uh, yeah, I guess we still have that, right? There we go. So, do that. You, open it. Good. Yeah, alright. You're getting a bit of a rhythm. I can see that doing pretty well. No, that's gonna... Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Oh, damn it. It's really awkward not having a red thing. Wait, can we get one from over... Hmm. No, I'm not sure where that was now. All right. I mean, it shouldn't be too difficult anyway, but... All right, throw. Jump. Good. Good. Come on. All right, good. This one... A little awkward. It gains a ton of speed, doesn't it? Um, I mean, I guess if you're facing it. Oh, look at that skills, skills, very good. Let's try and get over here without dying. Lovely. What we want? Smash some cobras. I assume that's a cobra. Probably not. Close. Oop. Oh, what are you butterflies? I feel like whenever we've seen them, there's actually been, like, uh, gems around. Hmm. Okay. Now, how do we do... Oh! Oh! Oh, shit. Oh. Well, actually, that doesn't matter, does it? Because we still got the gem. Oh, maybe that's intended. Because I was like, wait, how do you manage that to get back up? But I guess you probably don't have to. Yeah. Alright, that works. Oh, that oh that was pretty nice. Yeah, I think this is the way to go. You gotta turn. Let them fall off. Let that one get smacked. Too easy. Alright, very nice. Actually doing pretty well, I think. Relatively speaking. Oh, that that was actually pretty awesome, gotta say. 
Uh, that's a long jump, isn't it? What's with you guys? Hmm. Alright, let's just jump. <laughs> oh, that's... That doesn't look like a possible jump. I don't trust that jump at all. Hmm. Oh no. You press down and you fall straight through there. It doesn't matter if there's anything below it or not. Ah. Alright. This level's stepping up the difficulty. <laughs> sort of. I don't know. I don't know if you call it more difficult or I'm just failing more. Or a little of both. Probably a little of both. Oh shit. Uh, it's fine. Oh crap. Didn't... You know what? Go off the edge. Not in the mood for you. Oh, tricky. Eat that, bitch. <laughs> there we go. Very nice. Um, okay, no pressing down. Seriously, I can't believe I did that. Also, I was, I'm loving the shader. Like, it's it's sort of like, you know, it's it's blended in now. I'm not thinking about it, but it's good. I really like it. I honestly think I'd probably play the game through with this. Um, I think the only thing is the character model. It doesn't, like... It doesn't feel as good as the rest of it, for some reason to me. It's like... I feel like uh, the rest of it gets enhanced, whereas this, it, with the character model specifically, it feels like it takes a bit of detail away. I don't know if it's because it's like... I don't, I don't know. I don't quite have the words. Like, a little bit more washed out or something. I, I feel like that's not... I, I don't really have the words. <laughs> Let's, um... Turn it back off for a second to get a bit of a comparison feel. Oh man, that's yeah. I think it's maybe just the characters are a lot more vivid, but when it's on, they almost blend into the background more. So I don't know if these are the best ways to describe what I'm thinking, but is that like see what I mean? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. It's like I love the filter. I just I wish it could somehow be a little bit more vivid at the same time, you know. I think, yeah, so like the character's like a little too bright, maybe, or something. I don't know. Yeah, I'm not, uh... I'm not, it's like my eyes my eyes know something's up, but my brain doesn't know how to articulate it. But anyway, that aside. Can we, uh, break that? No, we cannot. Okay. Hello. Hello. Oh, I shouldn't be so cocky about that, should I? <laughs> I've got no, uh... I've got no red armor or whatever you'd... I mean, I guess you call it armor. But yes. Probably shouldn't be saying hello to snakes like that. But we did get a checkpoint, so now I'm happy. Very good. Yeah, see, the butterflies there. Which makes me think that over there, there was actually some of them up top, but I didn't see any way to get there. It could have been an invisible platform or something weird, maybe. I don't know. I wish these, like, just went to you. Like, I don't know why they're all Super Mario-y. <laughs> or just Mario-y, I should say, I guess. But, uh, you know, it's fine. Uh, let's have our hammer back, thank you. Check the roof. Ooh, what have we got? A mess. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, that is not cool. Yeah, see those butterflies? I, I don't know, I don't trust them. I mean, well, it's, it's, I guess it's not a matter of trust, but thumbs up. Uh, how are we doing on those? 100 and, 121? Not, not terrible. I don't feel like we're going to be anywhere close to getting them all, but we'll do our best. Why can I, oh. I, yeah, I don't know if we can see something over there. No, that's probably, yeah. All right. I assume there's probably something up there, but I, I don't know. I, I think that, like, you know, it's hard to, I guess you got to just sort of hit things, don't you? It's hard to fit, find some of the secret areas, because some of them are just invisible walls, like, you sort of just take the time to try and find that kind of thing. I guess if you're always throwing your hammer around, it can help. It's like it's bouncing somewhere. What is with that? Why is it... That just... It's like it was hitting the... I don't know. It looked like something strange was happening there. Uh, oh, that's awkward. Oh, look at that. I don't, oh. Uh, oh, there we go. <laughs> okay, that actually worked. Good. Uh, oh. Hello. Oh. That said nine, but like, sometimes they six, don't they? I wish you could actually... It's, it's sort of a... It's a strange system, though. Because I guess it's not actually... Because I was taking that, like, the health thing, but I guess it's more of a time thing. Isn't it? I assume. Because no matter what you get hit, you either... Like, it's, it's an insta-kill. Or it's you get one uh, shot... Uh, one hit from having this, so... 
Yeah, I don't know why I thought about it being like health, but no, I guess it's just a, a time association. Yeah. Ooh. So I don't know, I guess if that, like if you get one when you already got it, it resets back up to nine, or, it, or if they start at six, maybe if you, if you add on, it goes up to nine, or... Because I, I thought they start at nine, but then I'm pretty sure it seems it start at six, so... Oh, is this, uh... Do we have to... Oops, that... Oh, wait. Is that gonna... Is this how we do it? <laughs> Like it's probably not. Do we just stand on it until it's low enough? Is that all this is? Ah, okay. All right, let's see where this is gonna take us. Ah, I knew it. It had to be something, right? But is it gonna kill us? Ah, uh, I was gonna. <laughs> all right. I was curious if it was gonna just like smash us into the top, but all right. Not so bad. Wait, what? Oh, I was retracting it. Don't mind me. And oh, perfect. Jump, jump, jump. Yeah, it's probably actually, like I was saying about uh, the hidden walls and stuff, there's probably, like, things that indicate that, right? Like, you got those bees, or not bees, the firefly things and these, like, rats and there's other, like, there's probably things like that that might indicate it or something without, like, you know, something subtle. There's a lot of things along the lines of butterflies seemingly near um, groups of the gems that are up in the sky and stuff. So it could be something like that. Not too sure. Uh, we are up to 141 of that. That's not bad. Oh shit. Oh, is that? Yeah, like you got like a big like area like that, but hmm. I don't know. I'm sure we've missed some stuff. That's for sure. Cause we missed a ton in the second level. I was surprised. Especially after the first level was like pretty chill. Uh, all right. I think we must be coming up near the end of the level, which we did get the three uh. We did get the three big gems, the rubies, I guess, I don't know. I don't know what to actually call them, so I'm just, you know, blue gem and red gem. It's <laughs> probably the simple way to do it. Uh, okay. Do I break you? Am I going to regret that? Maybe. What, what, what the hell was that? Those were weird, right? Uh, I feel like I probably shouldn't have broke them. Okay, no, there's a lot of them. Are they... Should I be breaking them? Why do I feel like I shouldn't be? And yet I'm going to keep breaking them. Okay. Oh, it's up to 12. Oh. Oh, okay. So maybe it starts at 6 and every additional one adds 3. Ah. And this is open. Okay. Do I want to break these? This just looks like the thing that's going to snap closed, doesn't it? Maybe I should break all of these first. That'll either be a good move or a bad move. I figure that's probably the way that'll go. Alright, let's see if that'll do it. Ah, uh, not quite. Okay. How far can we... Ooh, okay. I, I said it may not even... Are we going to have to actually... Are we destroying stairs that we may need? It does seem like a possibility. <laughs> like that we're meant to actually make a set of stairs out of this or something, maybe? Would that make sense? I feel like it would. Something like that. Let's start with that anyway. Oh. Interesting. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, what the? Oh, okay. Wait, okay. I'm, I, ah, the thing I'm, I, I retract it too often. Like, it's really, I don't mean to. Like, it's just, it's very easy to do it. I think if we just do that. If that gets, like, stuck down there, that'll just keep smacking him. As long as we can avoid. Oh, alright, now he's moving. Oh, shit. That wasn't good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, crap. Need to get used to it. Uh, yeah, I, I retract it so much. I don't mean to. It's really awkward. Like that. Like I'm not. I'm, I'm just. It's like because it's a weapon. I'm just naturally trying to press it a bunch of times or something. When it's like that's not actually the way to do it with this. Uh, go down there. Go go go. Get stuck. Ah. That's probably not good. Go down there. Get him. All right. We're down. Oh shit. That was almost bad. 
All right, I think we're okay. Oh no! Get that, get that. Come on. Go. Go! Oh crap. Wait, if I just, can I hit him from there? Ah. Wait, does this work? Oh, I can just keep smacking him? Oh, all right. Wait, damn it. Yeah, I keep, ah, I just keep retracting it too early. It's such a, hmm. That's, that's a me thing. I'm not complaining about the controls or anything. Just, yeah, it's like, it's kind of going to want to like wail with it sort of thing. So stand up, yeah. But anyway, knocked out that boss one. It seemed a bit like, I didn't really could just go straight up next to it and just start smacking it. Like, that made it seem a little bit easier, but yeah. Very good. Very good. Which I assume is probably the end of the level. Fancy. But is there more? Oh, okay. What is this? Oh, Sky Rune Absorb. New ability obtained. Double jump. Very nice. Ah, awesome. Yeah, I like me some double jump. Nice. Broken Bridge, level 3 completed. Oh yeah, how do we actually do on that? Ah, uh, not too bad. Definitely better than the second level. Alright, awesome. Thanks for playing Tiny Thor Demo. Wishlist on Steam, join us on Discord, back to main menu. Yeah, that's uh, that's the demo then, very nice. And yeah, if you're interested, I do encourage to wishlist on Steam. It does help. And if you want to check it out, yeah, links in the description, uh, same as the last one. Yeah, that was good. I I'm glad I actually come back to try it out. I'm glad I finished the demo. I I guess I was a bit mixed on that. I afterwards, I thought, well, I kind of should have just finished it. It was like, what, an extra 20 minutes or something? like. So, yeah, I'm glad I actually just came back around to do that. The CRT gave me, uh, gave me an excuse to do that. Which I will say, um, overall, like, I, I obviously praise it a lot, and I do think it's really good. I just think it it's it's washing out. Like, that, that kind of stuck with me. I think you can even see it there, like, I don't know if it's just the colour palette of the main character, like, look at there, and then you, you throw it on, and it, it happens to everyone, like, you see, like, the villain's face obviously becomes a lot lighter, but whereas, like, the villain's face is lighter, our character feels like it's had, like, a spotlight on it or something, you know, it's, like, overexposed, whereas, like, that's, yeah, um, but then I also thought, um, whoops, I thought the uh, VGA looked a little better though. It's still it's still got that to it, but it has less of that. Overall, it's really solid though. I, I like this. Um, just a really cool thing to include for this type of art style. I think it works really well. This one, yeah, not not really a fan of this one. Um, but the VGA is really nice. VGA stretched. It's a very different colors. It's a. Uh, yeah, I think VGA or the uh, Aperture Grill is the one for me. Although, again, none also just looks good too. Because it's, uh, you know, really, you know, if you like this art style. Wait, we are on... Did I turn that off? Yeah, I did right. No, because it's... Oh, yeah, I was, I was confused there for a second. <laughs> I was like, wait, that's not quite right. Oh, yeah, I, hmm. Wait, so... What's, yeah, okay, I, I don't, I may have done comparisons before when it wasn't actually off. Hmm. So I thought CRT Mask None would have been new, but no, I guess it's still adding, okay. Anyway, <laughs> I think I've seen enough examples anyway, but yeah. Alright, well, I think that's all good for this one. Uh, no idea when this will be coming out, so I can't really say much too more on that, or if I'll be playing it or anything, but it was a solid demo, you know, um, probably about an hour of gameplay for me. A little bit less. Uh, I'm sure it could be done in like half an hour or something, but still, just a solid demo, I would say. It gives you a good idea of what the game's got to offer. Um, getting the double jump right at the end there, I think, also works well, just because it shows that there is a bit more to the game, that you may get some upgrades and things along the way, um, which is always cool. So, yeah, overall, I'd say Tiny Thor's looking pretty good. Um, yeah, not too much else to say, I don't think. It's just uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you have any suggestions for any other demos. And uh, yeah, just uh, hope you have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.